Hello, hello, all you beautiful people, and welcome to Hollywood Studios. And today is Star Wars Day, so happy Star Wars Day. May the 4th be with you. Hollywood Studios is a good place to go if you are a Star Wars fan. Everyone is dressed up in Star Wars. I'll let you see me in a little bit. I did buy a lightsaber because I just wanted to join in the fun. But if you're new here, hit that like button. And uh, if you like this content or you end up staying longer than three minutes of this video, you might as well consider subscribing. So heading over to Galaxy's Edge, uh, but I'm going to try some Star Wars treats because if you're in Hollywood Studios for May 4th and Revenge of the 5th, or uh, whatever day you want to celebrate Revenge of the 5th, it could be Revenge of the 6th, they have Star Wars treats. So going to go check them out, try and give you some reviews. So sit back, relax, and enjoy Hollywood Studios on Star Wars Day. I made it over to Trolley Car Cafe to try a dark side chocolate creation. It is a Darth Maul inspired dessert. It's featuring a milk chocolate and raspberry mousse swirled dome on a chocolate shortbread cookie capped with silvered almonds. Let me first off and say this. This is one of the most beautiful treats I've seen at Disney World. I was impressed. I love it. Darth Maul is one of my favorite characters, so this was a very exciting treat for me to try. And not only did it look amazing, but it tasted amazing as well. Like I said, it is milk chocolate and raspberry swirled on the inside. It is served cold and the texture is, for those who don't know what like a mousse cake is or mousse, it's like a whipped cream, like very fluffy. And so you have the chocolate, the milk chocolate on the outside and then the very inside it is a sweet dessert because it is chocolate with raspberry but y'all the best part is the chocolate shortbread cookie at the bottom that shortbread cookie mixed with the milk chocolate and raspberry heaven so delicious i highly recommend this it was very good and surprisingly i'm gonna give this one a 10 out of 10 bats next treat up is one of the most iconic faces in the star wars franchise a darth vader cupcake it is a chocolate cupcake with chocolate peanut butter buttercream dipped in dark chocolate ganache edged in darklet flakes and of course a chocolate darth vader head usually at disney world cupcakes become disappointing because of flavor etc etc but this one they did an excellent job chocolate with peanut butter together in this cupcake was an excellent choice it is very rich i will say that there's a lot of chocolate you got chocolate ganache chocolate flakes it's a chocolate cupcake and as you know peanut butter is already thick even though it's a peanut butter butter cream so just know it's a very thick cupcake disney likes to put a lot of frosting on it so i just have a bottle of water next to you but flavor wise very rich very moist a delicious great in chocolate great in peanut butter it will make your taste buds go crazy and this one i'm going to give it a 10 out of 10 bats I 
I made it over to this little cart that had lightsaber churros. So if you're a big fan of churros at the parks, they had lightsaber churros for Star Wars Day, which is pretty fun and exciting to try. They have a red and blue one. No, it's not strawberry or blueberry. They're just the sugar that are just dyed for the color. So I ended up getting the red one and you get a chocolate sauce for the dipping as well. And it pretty much just tastes like an ordinary churro. Nothing special about it, nothing significant, nothing added flavor. It's just a really good, delicious Disney churro. And with that being said, I'm going to give this one a nine out of 10 bats.